guys, it's Haley. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be trying on some of MAC's new holographic lip colors and I'm super, super excited. It's something I would normally not wear every day, so I can't wait to show you. If you're interested, then keep on watching. Okay, so let's just get started. I'm gonna go ahead and try out these Grand Illusion Holographic Liquid Lip Colors. Whew, that's a tongue twister. So the first one we're starting out with is fluorescence, and as you can see, it's like a really pretty, like pearly yellow. I'm gonna just swatch this on my wrist. From my understanding, these lip colors are really comfortable wear, and they're a little plumping and have like a minty kick to them. So this is the first one. It's like a really pretty sunflower yellow fluorescence. I like this one, it's pretty. The next one is almost like a pink orange. I like this one. Electric rainbow. Ooh, okay, Mac. I'm loving these names. And I can already tell, but ooh, you guys. This mix with that fluorescence would be bomb because the fluorescence color is almost like in this one. Oh my goodness. Wait till you see this. You're going to die. Look at that. Do you see this? Look how pretty that is. Even these two together, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, so then the third one, Rave Bunny. Okay, that's a cute name. And this definitely looks like the colors that would be in someone's rave outfit. It's like, almost like a bright metallic magenta. I like this one a lot. I would rock this one with like a Barbie pink liner. So cute, super pretty. I like this one a lot. Okay, so the fourth one is Twinkle Twink. That's cute. So this is like a more of an orange, like a true orange than that pink orange we had. I like this one. I feel like this would be really pretty on like those like yellowy skin tones with like a tan, super pretty, that orange shade. I really, really like that one. Okay, so the next one we're gonna do is Pearly Girl. I think I might actually try this one on. Ooh, yes, I'm definitely trying this on. I'm gonna show you how it swatches first. I really like this one. I'm putting this one on, for sure. Okay, so I'm gonna try Pearly Girl on. I just put some on my hand. I already have some lipstick on, but I feel like this is gonna look really pretty with my eyeshadow, so let's see. Oh, yes. Oh, I like this a lot. Let's add some more. I like applying it with the finger. I feel like when you're, you could mix them this way and really get like a custom color and then blend it out with my finger. Ooh, that looks bomb. I like it layered, oops. We'll fix that in a second. I like it layered on top of like another color. Cause I feel like it gives it that depth and dimension and I see it's like, it feels like I have toothpaste on my lips. Like it's very minty and like refreshing. It's not like a burning sensation like some plumping lipsticks have. That looks pretty, yes. And that's the, which one is it? The Pearly Girl. Definitely would wear this every day, mixed in. And it looks like good with like my show gold highlight. Okay, Mac, I see you, I see you. Okay, so this next one is Gilded Age. Oh, I like that name. So let's just swatch it. Ooh, oh, is this like a copper? Like a true copper bronze. Oh, oh my God. I would want this as a liner. You're gonna die when you see this. That bronze color right there, I cannot. Imagine that on your eye as a wing. Bomb. 
Yes. Okay, so then the next one we're gonna do is Let's Rock. This one has like, it's like a pink, I wanna say like pinkish yellow, but it has a little hint of green in it. I like this one. I feel like I'm doing an art project. <laughs> uh, remember as a kid, like spin art, when you would do all those paints and they would end up like looking all these like crazy different colors. I feel like that's what they did in the lab when they made these. So this is Let's Rock. I feel like I could rock out to this color. Play a little drums, maybe a little guitar, you know? I like that one a lot. Okay, so now we're gonna do Pink Trip. This is gonna be like a purple pink. They have a lot of similar colors in this collection, but the hints of colors that are in each one are so different that I think that's what makes each one unique. And I really, really like that a lot. This one is pretty. I feel like this one's a little subtle. Would be really pretty over like a purple liner. That one's really nice, right? Don't you feel like, like over like a nice purple liner, it's like just enough spunk, you know? Not too much. I like it. So this next one is Sensory Overload. I wanna say it's like a blue, purple, green, but it has like a little gray. Reminds me of like Avatar, Avatar color. Oh yeah, this is definitely Avatar. It's really pretty, it like really ombres out to like that purple and blue. Sensory overload, okay. Even though I think they should name it Avatar, but you know. It's really, really pretty. You can see like the dimension in the color. I love that one. Okay, this next one is Lunar Module. I want to, I feel like it's like the one before, but a lighter version, like baby colors of it. So let's see. This is like unicorn. Like real unicorn colors right here. Because it's lighter, you need to add, I feel like a little bit of like more, a pretty generous amount. It's swatching nice, but anything that's lighter, you need to add some more. Yeah, there's no other word but unicorn for this one. It's really, really pretty. For someone who wants like a metallic lip but doesn't want to go too crazy, I feel like this one is for you. You see how it's like subtle, but it's enough? It'd be like a really great top coat for like a natural lip. If you have like a natural makeup but want a little pop, this one would be perfect. And who doesn't want to be a baby unicorn? Okay, this next one, I really like the name. It's kind of long, but it's really good. I feel like it's very MAC. Peace, love, unity, respect. Isn't that cute? And it's green, so I feel like it reminds me of Christmas. So let's see, oh yeah, oh my God. This is so And I usually don't wear like, honestly, I don't wear a lot of green makeup, but this color right here, ooh, oh my gosh. This is pretty. Okay, I gotta show you, you're gonna die. Like for green, like green is a hard color to wear. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? And it's green. Like how many green lips do you see walking down the street? But I know you would wear this one. Don't lie to me. Such, such a pretty color. So the second to last one is Queen's Violet. Perfect for a queen and it's purple. And that's my favorite color, so I think it's meant to be. They made this one for me, okay? And it's literally the color. It's such a pretty violet. I gotta be honest with you guys, I was a little nervous about this collection because I am obsessed with nude lips and I don't really like consistently go crazy with my lips, but these, I feel like I could rock every day. Cause you don't have to cover your entire lip with it. You can just do like a little pout in the middle. You can mix it or you could do a whole look with it, whatever you want to do. And yeah, this is gorgeous. Isn't that pretty? It's like a true violet. So pretty. This one I would rock as a liner too. I feel like, I wonder if it's, you can, I feel like you could use it on your eye. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I'll test it out. Stay tuned. This last one is space bubble. And I think I'm gonna try this one on. Oh yeah. This is like a gold violet. It's got some like burnt yellow in it. Oh my gosh, this is pretty. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna pop this on top of what we have because this is too gorgeous to not try on. I'm gonna show you the swatch first. Oh my gosh, so pretty. 
Space Bubble. These names, who comes up with these names, I wonder? So this is Space Bubble right here. Isn't that gorgeous? That's gonna look good with what we already have on, so I'm gonna try it on for you. Okay, so I'm just putting some on my hand because I wanna use my finger. All right, Space Bubble, let's see what you're working with. <gasps> Oh, this is nice. When you're layering them, I feel like you really gotta blend them because they can look a little. <sighs> I was just gonna tell you they were gonna look splotchy and then look what I just did. Oh my gosh, like really, Haley? <sighs> All right, let's wipe this off. Oh my gosh, now it's like staining my cheek. We're back in action. Okay, I'm gonna keep blending this. That looks pretty. Okay, I would rock this whole look. Tell me you wouldn't rock this. And everyone's gonna be like, oh, what do you want on our lips? I'm like, oh, my secret combination. Cause you know, we did mix too. This looks pretty. I really like these. And they're really, really comfortable. Like, really comfortable. Not tacky, not sticky. I don't feel like my hair is gonna be like flopping in my mouth. Like I would wear this all day. Overall, I like am super, super excited for this collection. I just wanna go out shopping and have everyone ask me about my lips because honey, my lips are popping right now and I know you can't deny it. Like look at these swatches. Look at these swatches. Do you see all these colors and dimension? Like this is crazy. Definitely a fan, 100%. So I really, really love this collection. Super happy with it. It's comfortable wear. I love the colors, how it's picking up on every, like I feel like it'll look great on any single skin tone. Like every single skin tone. Everyone's gonna have a little like different to it. You can pair them differently. You can just literally create a custom lip that no one is gonna know what you're wearing, but everyone's gonna be staring, I promise you. I love it. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this as much as I did. Make sure to subscribe down below, give me a thumbs up, and hit that bell one time, okay? That way you can stay notified for all my videos. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.